Hey guys, today it's Epic Cinemax and I'm gonna show you how to make some like I'm, I'm gonna show you how to make a fraction and decimate a decimal conversion and make a soft visual basic. So let's open that up right now. Okay. We're, we're gonna be doing a new project. I made a bunch of other projects, I've already made one and stuff, so let's make a new project. We'll call it Tut. And make sure it's a Windows Form application. Once you have made a Windows Form application, let's wait for it to load. You wanna click there. Then you might want to change like the name down here to Tut or something if you want to. Doesn't really matter. Once you make it Tut or whatever, you you wanna need to go to Tools and we're gonna need three text boxes. So let's drag those out if I can find them. I found one. Okay, let's go for the second one. Okay, found the second one. So, what I'll do, this program will basically convert fractions to decimals. So it's good for schoolwork and stuff. Okay, and that's three. Yeah, okay. You may, you might want to add in a bunch of extra stuff like an equal sign and stuff, but I'm not gonna do that for the sake of time. Once you're there, I want to call this one num. Next one, I want to call it den. Next one, I want to call uh, des for decimal. So once you do that, next we're gonna put in a button saying convert. Okay, it says num, den, and des. So now we're gonna put in the button. Let's find the button. Ah, there it is. Let's put it in. We're gonna say it, say convert. This actually isn't really that hard. Convert. Now you're gonna double click it. And now the code is actually extremely easy. It is uh, text box one dot. This first space bar will most likely be text. Then equals space. And then type in. Uh, you know, not not one three. Yeah, three equals text box one dot text. dot text then the slash text box two dot text and that's it. Now you can test it out. You see twenty four twenty four over sixty seven over I recommend that you change this decimal box into multi line just in case the decimal is like huge and something you'll be able to see the decimal so that's basically it so there you have your thing already your decimal if you try to put in letters just like I just did it will crash and then you start again you have to click the stop debugging button like I just did so 2456 and numbers you'll see it has like error like, no not error, exponent negative 6 it'll show that stuff for some reason so that's basically your simple fraction to whatever yeah so it's good for little kids who don't know how you're supposed to convert them like if the little kid doesn't know how to convert it from fraction to decimal and stuff if they're like they don't know or something if they don't know how to divide then they just punch it in there, then you get it. Like, that's it. I hope you enjoyed watching.